all right everyone in this video i am going to show you how you how to add no capture or recapture to your laravel application using this package no capture so what we are going to do in this video let me show it to you uh, the default uh, jet stream form but here we need to fill this uh, capture in order to submit this form so if i try to submit this without filling the capture it will throw an error that your response field is required so actually it says this field is required uh, you can change this as well custom you can create custom messages so this is the default uh, name for this so if i fill the form and click on the, there that i am not a robot and then click on register now as you can see i am registered in this website so let's get started First, we need to install this package uh, in order to use uh, recapture or no capture on your Laravel application. So, and, and this link will be given in the description below. So, first, we need to install using Composer. So, just copy this command and paste it in your terminal. This will install this package. And once this is done, then we need to add this to our config app file uh, in service provider. So, let's go to uh, config, config app. And inside providers array, we need to add that line. So I'm going to paste it here. Now we need to add the alias for this. So just copy this and paste it right here. Now save this file. And now we are we just need to publish this configuration. So PHP artisan window publish and this so just copy that and paste it in your terminal. This will publish the no capture configuration, and then we need uh, uh, no capture secret and side key. So we are just uh, using this for testing purpose. So we will use the the testing uh, key and side side key and secret. So uh, I paste those in my in env file. Now we need the secret and side key. So uh, here on developer.google.com or I will also provide this link in the description below so for testing purpose they are providing site key and site secret and they are also inside that if you are using this for testing purpose then this red line this, then you will see this red line on the on top of this recapture now we need to add this site key so let's go back to VS code and site key is this now let's uh, just copy the secret so copy and first save this file we are we are almost done we are just uh, we just need to add these to our blade files so let's go to we need to uh, i want to add this on the registration form so let's go to register.blade register.blade.php here and after passwords let's add that it uh, it renders the 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 javascript file so now let's uh, display that so we need to copy this one and paste it below that one so now save this file this will uh, show that uh, so let's register it will show that I'm pretty sure yeah as you can see it is displaying that here but we need to add some some logic and uh, we need to add we need to add this role inside validation so let's go back and go to register uh, register user controller register user controller here we need to add that uh, to, to not fast this uh, form until the user has put that uh, capture so the user has fill, had filled that capture so let's add that and let's configure that now that's it and this is the default name you can configure this and change this to uh, something else and you can you can customize this you can create separate or uh, customizable messages as well as you can see they are providing help please verify that you are not a robot you can do this as well all right so i think we are almost done now let's give it a try if i refresh this page and fill the form but I'm not filling the capture, so let's click on register. And as you can see, the capture response field is required, so I think this works now. And we see this red 
uh, message because we are using the uh, the API the site key and secret uh, key just for testing purpose we copy copy it from uh, this Google uh, developer Google so it is just for testing purpose now if I uh, fill this form and fill the captcha so let's see what's going to happen now if I click on register and yes here we go it works fine so that's how you can add uh, captcha no captcha to your Laravel application using this package Laravel package and we can customize this as well so let's uh, customize your template theme is dark so let's use this one in our register blade so from here we change the theme data theme to dark so now uh, save this file and let's see if it changes the color so actually go to register and As you can see the theme is dark so it is on black color now so if i fill the form and fill the captcha and click on register as you can see i am now registered so that's how you can add a captcha to your laravel registration form so that's it for this video make sure to like and subscribe to this channel thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one